Welcome in CACPHP 3 tutorial. This tutorial on password match validation. And uh, in this tutorial, I will go. I will use a simple method called same as for password ma match. And this method uh, has been added uh, from CACPHP version 3.2. So if you are using CACPHP 2 or greater than CACPHP 2, then you can uh, use this method called same as. If you are using uh, less than uh, 3.2, then you can use compare with validation. So let it let it start. Uh, I already created a simple form to add uh, a new user, and you can see you are sh showing in here. There has actually four fields: uh, user, username, email, password, and rule. So for this tutorial, I'm going to add a new field called password match below this password field. So at first I'm going to my project folder and uh, the, my project folder name is validation and there is a folder called src that means source and this source has a folder called template and this template has a uh, folder called users and this users has a file called add.ctp. So I have already generated my code using cacback for my table users so you know that if you uh, using cacback it will uh, create your uh, mvc that means model view controller uh, on that already created so you can see there has a folder called users this is actually the view so in this template uh, folder you will show these uh, users and this users has a file called address ctp and this uh, address ctp there is a field name called password so i'm just uh, going to copy this uh, line and paste below this password and I'm going to change this name password match and I'm going to mention the uh, field type the field type will be password so after save if I just going to show in browser so you uh, here password match uh, field has been added uh, below password field so now I'm going to add a new rule for password match field so you know that uh, all validation rule will be add in model and there has uh, a, a folder called table and for users controller for your users, users table or users table there is a uh, file has been generated called users table and all validation rule has been added here for users controller so in below I'm going to add a new validation rule for password match so validator and I'm going to add a new rule called same as the same as method actually uh, under the validator class so you are sh you uh, I have already use this name space in here validator and uh, if I just want to see the uh, method same as you can see the here is the same as method and there has actually four parameters and uh, uh, there are actually four parameters and uh, uh, the first two parameter are field and second field and both are mandatory and the second two parameter are masses and when uh, is optional and uh, if you just uh, now use this uh, method in here you have to mention first uh, field name so my field name is password match second field name is password because I want to ma I wanted to match uh, my password match uh, field with password field this third parameter uh, is optional but I am just uh, adding my own uh, message that means own error message in here so I'm typing password match failed so after save if I just go for add a new user in here after refresh the page and I'm going to add a new user and add a uh, and give a wrong password I have type here 123 and here is 1234 now after the submit you are showing the validation error in here password match failed so if I just uh, type 123 and after submit the user has been saved 
so here is the output so this is actually uh, today's tutorial uh, thanks for watching welcome for the next tutorial